concrete slab lifter. Workers around the world use a wide variety of equipment, materials and techniques during road construction. The approach is tailored to each individual case based on the terrain and the requirements for the future roadway. When it comes to light roads and driveways, the most appropriate solution is concrete slab paving because it allows you to significantly save time. Nevertheless, some parts of the process could be improved. The most common way of installing concrete slabs is using heavy machinery and systems of hooks and chains. However, this method has a negative impact on the overall speed of the work. So, here's another solution. Instead of an excavator, in this case, a boom truck is used. That is, instead of two pieces of equipment, you only need one. The truck moves on the roadbed, while the slabs are stored near the laying area. Another interesting feature of this technology is the absence of metal hooks on the slabs. The boom of the truck is equipped with a special vacuum suction cup, which locks onto the concrete slab in a matter of seconds. Therefore, moving from one place to another and then installing the slab takes only a few seconds, and the whole procedure can be performed by only one person operating the boom. This is a great way to save time and money. There's no need to hire a team to attach the chains to the hooks and then move the slab to the right place. Virgula Super 3003i Construction companies always try to build highways and runways as quickly as possible. In this case, time is money, because while a new road is being paved, the town has to change routes and increase expenses. However, there is a piece of machinery that allows you to save money by increasing productivity on construction and repair sites. You're seeing it on the screen right now. The Super 3003i is a paver developed by the German company Virgula. It's the largest paver in the entire range of the renowned brand. Although the machine itself is only 3 meters wide, it can asphalt roadways up to 18 meters wide. This means that the Super 3003i does not take up much space when transported and parked. The machine is capable of paving up to 5 lanes at a time, making it Tesmec 1150XHD Rockhog. Now let's move on to a machine that breaks things instead of building them, because this is also an important process on repair and construction sites. Traditional methods of dismantling used road surfaces are not very efficient. When working on large projects, you have to use a lot of specialized equipment. An alternative and much more convenient option is using a stone crusher like this one. The 1150XHD Rockhog was developed by the Italian company Tesmec. Actually, it's actively used in quarries to dig pits, as well as quickly create channels and trenches. But here, the stone crusher is used to dismantle used asphalt in the shortest possible time. The working tool with its large number of teeth bites into the roadbed. The impact is so powerful and destructive that in a matter of seconds the asphalt becomes a fine crumb. The material is then removed very quickly and easily using a road grader. To increase productivity, the Tesmec 1150XHD is equipped with a 312cm wide drum. In addition, the drum breaks the roadbed at a depth of up to 30cm. The crusher's working speed varies from 0.5 to 1.5 meters per minute, which could seem slow, but only at first glance. Vertgen SP1200 Here's another way to quickly and easily build a new road or repair an old one, laying concrete pavement. This is the SP1200 paver developed by the German company Vertgen. Its principle of operation is quite simple. 
The machine uses a loading conveyor or an endless screw to feed the concrete into a slip form. It then creates an even roadway using the liquid material. Another advantage of this paver is that it can perform all kinds of tasks. The Vertgen SP1200 can pave roads ranging from 4,000 to 12,000 meters in width using removable molds of various sizes. Therefore, one machine is suitable for a wide variety of projects. If desired, the performance can be increased using attachments. The paving machine can be equipped, for example, with a tool that automatically hammers anchors or reinforcement rods into the concrete. Optimus H88 Nowadays, there are many types of road. No matter what you're trying to build, you can find a machine that will help you cope with the construction faster and easier. The Optimus H88 is designed to create pedestrian walkways and areas made of paving flags. The vehicle allows you to perform a full work cycle. First of all, we're talking about laying the material. Some time ago, this procedure was performed exclusively by hand. The builders used to invest a lot of time and effort, and after a day at work, they suffered from back pain. The Optimus H88 has a special grip that picks up and then places the slabs one by one. Once the tiles have been laid, the Optimus H88 changes the working tool. Now, special brushes fill the joints between the tiles with special dry mortar. Previously, this step was also performed manually using mops. Once the work is done, the Optimus H88 will remove the excess of mixture using a completely different attachment. Power Kerber Slip Form Machines Today, we've already shown machines that create roadbeds using special molds. But since concrete is a liquid material that can take a variety of shapes, it has other applications in road construction. Power Kerber is a company that produces and sells curb pavers. These machines use concrete and special molds to create a wide variety of objects. For example, curbs of different sizes, gutters, and road barriers. They can also be equipped with formwork to form narrow parts and sidewalks. The company's model range includes a rather large number of machines. We've chosen the most interesting ones in our opinion. These are the 7700 and the 5700C models. Midland Mix Paver The last machine we're going to show you today simply lays a fresh layer of asphalt on an old roadway. Nevertheless, it does it in an unusual way. It uses a technology known as cold mix paving. The main difference lies in the mixture used. It has a slightly different composition. Instead of viscous bitumen, it consists of liquid bitumen, which thickens slowly or at a medium speed. Cold mix is prepared without using high temperatures too, and on top of that, it doesn't need to be heated before paving. So why do people use this technology? The fact is that hot asphalt can only be laid under certain temperature conditions. Cold mix can be used even in cold seasons, as well as in snow and rain. However, the performance remains high. As you can see, the material can be laid pretty quickly. Hey, stop being lazy, it's time to use that brain of yours. Welcome to Brain Time. Incredible facts from the past, the present, and even the future. The power of nature and wild animals. Amazing facts and unsolved mysteries. You'll find all this and much more here. Subscribe now, you won't regret it.